Hello friends, welcome back to another video. In this video, I will be providing you the solution of our arcade base camp third lab, which is monitoring multiple projects with cloud monitoring. Before starting the solution of this lab, I simply want to inform you that I already uploaded the solution of the previous two labs, which is available in the form of the playlist on my YouTube channel. The link of this playlist is already in the description box. Up description box me jaake ki dono lab access kar sakte hain. Abhi tak nahi kiye to jaake jaldi se complete kar le. Now quickly jumping into the third lab. Open the lab. It would be a little bit lengthy. So stick with me. थोड़ा सा solution लंबा हो सकता है. लेकिन हम जल्दी से जल्दी से complete करने की कोशिश करेंगे. First of all, start the lab. Click on start lab button. Wait for the credentials to be loaded up. After that, copy the password from here. This is the password. Copy the password. Right click upon open Google Cloud Console and open it in incognito window only. Okay, incognito mode में ही open करना है. Now click on the next button. Paste the password that we just entered. Hit enter button. Now click on I understand button. And we are logged in into our Google Cloud Console. Here we need to accept uh, our terms and condition. A pop up will arise here. Let's see. Yes. So click on check my progress. Oh, and not to check my progress. Check box. Click on agree and continue button. Now, uh, as we the name suggests of this lab, we have to work with different different multiple projects. So first we will come back to the lab and switch to the second uh, project. So for that we need the user ID project ID. Copy the second project ID. Copy the second project ID. Okay. This one is the first ID and this is the second ID. So we need to copy the second ID. So click on the copy button. Come back to here. Click on this arrow button. End the search bar. Paste the uh, project ID that we just copied and uh, wait for it. And you will see your project ID. So click on this button. And it will load the new project. Okay, now we will be working in this project. So first of all, activate the compute engine. Click on this button. Come back to here. We are done with this task. We need to create a new instance. So copy the name of the instance from here. Copy it very carefully. Don't copy the full stop at the end. यहाँ पर जो side में छोटा सा full stop दिख रहा है, ये copy नहीं करना है. Only copy the name of the instance. Copy it very carefully. Come back to here. Click on create new instance button. You can simply cut this panel. Wait for it to load. We have to remove this name and paste the new name that we just copied. Now for the region and zone, it's given to us. For my case, it's US East 4 and zone is US East 4 C. In your case, it can be different. So use your zone and region. Okay, आपको अपना region और zone use करना है. So come back to here. It's US East 4 C, right? Yes, 4 C. Okay, so come back to here and uh, no other changes required. Simply click on the create button. Now wait for the instance to be created. It will take around one minute to be created. Once it's get created, you will get the green tick here. So, जैसे आपको ग्रीन टिक मिल जाएगा आपका फर्स्ट टास्क भी कम्प्लीट हो जाएगा सो कम बैक क्लिक ऑन चेक माई प्रोग्रेस एंड वंस योर इंस्टेंस गेट क्रिएटेड यू विल गेट द ग्रीन टिक असेसमेंट कम्प्लीटेड नाउ इन द सेकंड टास्क वी नीड टू क्रिएट अ मॉनिटरिंग मेट्रिक्स स्कोप सो फॉर दैट यू नीड टू कॉपी सम यस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी नीड टू कॉपी द ग्रुप नेम डेमो ग्रुप कॉपी इट वेरी केयरफुल अगेन डोंट कॉपी द फुल स्टॉप एट द एंड जिस साइड में छोटा सा फुल स्टॉप दिख रहा है कॉपी नहीं करना है सिर्फ आपको इसका नेम कॉपी करना है सो कॉपी इट वेरी केयरफुल कम बैक टू हेयर and uh, from yes in the search bar we need to type monitoring so search for monitoring and open this monitoring now this monitoring tab will take a little bit time to open once it gets loaded you will see all the options here in the left panels and from the left panel scroll down keep scrolling we need to open the groups so open the groups and create a new group and for the name paste the group name that we just copied and we need to give the group value so come back to here and scroll down uh, we need the group value so where is the group value let me check so the value is the instance so we need to copy this very carefully again don't copy the full stop full stop copy nahi karna hai sirf instance name copy karna hai and value mein paste karenge click on the done button click on create button uh, wait for it to load once it get created we will move to the next task so once the page get loaded simply come back to the lab we are done with this task click on check my progress you will get the green tick for the task number 2 let's try again yes don't worry if in your first try you won't get the green tick agar aapko ek baar mein green tick nahi mile then again click on the check my progress aapko green tick mil jayega okay now coming to the third part we need to third task we need to uh, use the uptime check for the group so it's given that we need to set the protocol to tcp resource type would be instance port would be 22 we need to select our group so let's do this task also so simply come back to here and from the left panel scroll up a little bit and open this uptime checks open it create a new uptime check the http will be the protocol would be tcp resource type would be instance 
uh, applies type would be group and we need to select our group that we just created code number 22 and uh, check frequency would remain one so click on pre continue button and here we if you need to click on the continue button again uh, untick this and click on continue button we need to give the title so for the title come back to here and the title is given to us this would be the title Copy it very carefully again. Don't copy the full stop. So, and may it as a full stop. I copy nahi karna hai. Sif aapko title copy karna hai. Okay. So, now come back to here. Place the title. And just simply click on the create button. We don't need to test it. Simply click on the create button. Now, wait for it to get created. Come back to the lab. Scroll down. Click on the check my progress. You will get the green tick for the task number 3 also. Don't worry if you don't get the green tick in the first task. और एक इन द फर्स्ट ट्रायल अगर आपको एक बार में ग्रीन टिक नहीं मिले तो पैनिक नहीं होना है दो तीन बार ट्राई कीजिएगा ग्रीन टिक मिल जाएगा नाउ कमिंग टू द नेक्स्ट पार्ट वी नीड टू यूज द अलर्ट पॉलिसी फॉर द पॉलिसी फॉर द ग्रुप ओके सो वी नीड टू सेलेक्ट द टाइम चेक व्हिच इज ऑलरेडी चेकड एंड आफ्टर दैट वी नीड टू गो टू द अलर्ट एड अलर्ट पॉलिसी ओके सो कम टू हियर क्लिक टू दिस क्लिक ऑन दिस थ्री डॉट्स वी नीड टू अपडेट द पॉलिसीज एक्चुअली वी वी नीड यस वी नीड टू गो टू द अलर्टिंग फ्रॉम द लेफ्ट पैनल सेलेक्ट द अलर्टिंग टैब Here we will create a new policy. So click, click on create policy. So first of all, click on set, select a metric and untick this active button. Click on this active button and you will see the checkbox is removed. Now come back to here. First of all, yes, we need to select for the search for the check pass. So copy it very carefully. Come back to here, paste it under here. You will see the check pass. So scroll down. Yes, you will see VM instances. Click on this, click on uptime check, click on this check passes, click on apply button. Okay. Here we need to add a filter. So click on add a filter button. Come back to here. Scroll down. So for the filter, we need to use this ID. Copy it very carefully. Come back to here. Paste it here. Mm -hmm. Okay. We copied the wrong one. We need to use check ID as the filter. So copy it. Come back to here. Paste it here. You will see check ID. Select it. For the value, come back to the lab. Copy the, this value, demo group, uptime, check ID. So copy it very carefully. Come back to here, paste it under the value. Wait for it to be load. Click on scroll down. Uh, yes, click on done button. Now we can scroll down and click on the next button. Now for configuring, configuring the alert triggers, come back to the here. And uh, first of all, we need to select from the left panel on the error method. Okay, so metric absence. Okay, so we need to select the metric absence. So come back to here. Select the metric absence. Click on the next button. Untick, untick this use notification channel. Scroll down. We need to give the name to the alert policy. So come back to here. Scroll down a little. And uh, for the name, we would be using this as uptime check policy. Copy it very carefully. Again, don't copy the full stop at the end. Chota sa side mein full stop dekh raha hai, copy nahi karna hai. Okay, come back to here. Paste the name. Click on the next button and click on the create policy button. Now wait for it to get created. Once the page gets loaded, simply come back to the lab. Click on the check my progress. You will get the green tick for sure. You can see we get the green tick and assessment is completed. No other task is remained to be done. Congratulations, your lab is completed. Now you don't have to do anything. Simply click on the end lab button. Click on end lab button once again. Give the star rating that you want to give. Also, you can leave any additional comment if you want. Click on the submit button. Come back to the main page to verify whether we get the green tick or not. We scroll down a little bit, open it, and you can see we get the green tick beside our lab. It means we successfully completed this lab. Okay, so if you like the video, make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. If you have any query, you can ask me in the comment box or on the WhatsApp group. Thank you very much. Goodbye.